Hi, cat. Hey, guys. I'm starting off the vlog with a random cat that just walked up to me. Hi, kitty. Hi, kitty, baby, baby. Hi, cutie pie. Oh, my God. You're so beautiful. Oh, my God. It's all over me. Where's your owner? Hi, kitty, kitty, kitty. Oh, boy. I said we had dominion over a uh, little creepy collie things. He wasn't lying. So my package came. I got it. Oh my god! Look at my package came. I got a new book. It's called Prophetic. I'll just show it to you. The sun will come out on today. Yeah. Prophetic Evangelism by Sean Smith. The same dude whose wife gave me that word. I don't think I played that video on this channel. So I'll leave a link in the description for you to go watch my testimony video. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. Don't you just love new book smell? Like, but this one doesn't have a smell. Kind of smells like Cheerios and water. Like, I know I, this one, I, I didn't mean this doesn't have a smell. I meant more so that, like, this book doesn't smell like a book. It smells like water and Cheerios. <laughs> the Cheerios. I'm ugly. Why do you guys watch me? But if you do, please subscribe to my channel and, like, let your, your spouse know your boyfriend know, your girlfriend know, your best friend know, like how much you enjoy this channel and get them to watch me too and also subscribe to my channel because, oh my god, I'm about to walk smack into a freaking web of spider. It's the same day as the cat <laughs> and we're going to Panera. I have one client to meet with and I'm wearing this. But it's online, so that's why I have a collar. I'm smart, right? Yeah, I have a client, and Rob has an S stomach. And then we're gonna study 4X. And then, well, he's gonna study 4X. I'm gonna finish my book. And then go follow me on Instagram if you haven't already. Shasha Hewitt, C H Y C H Y H E W I T T T. That's what's going on with my hair right now like a pyramid hey i'm not the illuminati though it has been a real life struggle to get done writing this book and it's simply because of procrastination so i literally have to coach myself and i'm gonna like write out the coaching session and be like yo why do you want to write this book why are you not writing it um what's gonna happen how are you gonna feel if you don't write it like i'm literally about to have to coach myself and I may or may not show this in show that in this video, but I'm definitely gonna make a whole video about that separately. But anyways, yeah, can you see these bags? Oh my goodness. I have like all type of skin problems going on. Oh my god, they're so far. As you can tell, I just woke up. Don't get that armpit. It's church today. And I actually wrote a little bit of my book again. Um, I don't know what we have planned today, so I guess we'll just see. Not that you guys care or anything. I don't think I vlogged at all yesterday. Oops, I'm sorry. I was in Panera and I didn't get anything done. Like, nothing. There was this interracial couple. I was like, woo, yay. They were like older. I thought they were interracial. There was this tall white dude, like 45, 50. And then there was this tall woman that was like chocolate brown. She had a visor on, she had sunglasses. I was like, why do you gotta have a sunglasses on if you have a visor on, or why do you have to have a visor if you have sunglasses, whatever. But then, as they near the door of Panera, she takes off her stuff, and the woman is Caucasian. There's nothing wrong with that. I mean, it's just the fact that she was so tan that I thought she was like brown skin. I was like, honey, you're a little older, you know, you gotta take care of your skin, so it's not good for your skin. So they say, though. So they say, you know, actually, they always tell us stuff that's not good for us when it is good for us. So what if this sun is? But nah, I, I have blotches all over my skin from the sun, so that can't be the case. Wow, my under eyes is horrible. I gotta go put concealer on. Oh my gosh, I've been such a bad vlogger, but I'm already a bad vlogger. 
to begin with. So right now I'm walking to go meet Robert at, at this job he's doing. He needs the receipts. I'm going to walk all the way there and get it to him. I have to walk for like 35 minutes. And these are not, these boots were not made for walking, bro. And then I'm going to walk back. So a whole hour is going to be done and wasted. But it's not wasted because it's for Bay. And then after that, I think I'm going to try to actually sell some stuff on Depop. The bus that I have to catch to go meet Rob is coming at 11.26. And it's 11.20 and it's taking me like five minutes to get there. But I have to pee so bad. So I think that I am just going to pee on myself today. 24 year old peeing on herself is what I should title this video. Luckily, I didn't pee on myself. I'm gonna walk to shoppers and pee. Since you guys are so interested in my piss life. I'm just kidding. Or am I? Mm, hi, parents. Now, I'm on my way to meet Caitlin for food, for dinner at Longhorn. Um, oh, she's walking out. She doesn't even see me. So it is the next morning, I'm going to my mom's house. I just came from Panera, of course. I'm going to get out my Depop clothes and post them. So I will show you guys a little bit of that. Try to watch some vlogs. Kennedy Walsh has a new vlog and she said it's her best one yet and I want to see that. But yeah, stuff's going on today. Um, do you like want to see my clothes? They're like in a like suitcase like It's like no, these are clothes that I'm selling. That's psych no because I'm actually doing it So, you know when people say psych that means it's actually not the case, but this is the case So why did I say psych? So I just edited my video like the video that you guys are watching At the beginning of the vlog I was like very enthusiastic and in the middle I was just like I'm doing that. I'm a freaking robot. And now I'm like really energized. So I apologize for the inconsistency. But let's get into the first thing I'm selling. Okay. This bad boy right here. It has like a nice cute high neck. It's really slinky. It's form fitting. So it shows off your goods. Yada yada yada. This thing I had for 525,600 years. Again, this is very form fitting. It has a long slit. I've worn this 5,688 times. And it's busting at the seams because my butt grew. This is good for winter. We're in the fall season. Shout out to all my fall people. Who else was born in the fall? Autumn, baby. That's why my middle name's Autumn. Not that anyone cares. Um, this is a polo. This might be a little more pricier just because it's a polo. It's very comfy, thick. Shoot, I'm like, keep this. Next pair of jeans, I have, I got these from Forever 21, and like I said, my butt grew, and the zipper just never wants to zap. Um, this Vans shirt, this is literally, I'm probably going to sell this for like $3, because it's just this, you know. This was probably $15. I used to work at Vans, for some of you who don't know. So I got all these clothes, like, discounted, but... This shirt I was never able to wear because my stomach is just too fat and it's a crappie. This is the back actually. This is the front. It's a crop top. It's really cute. I thought I was going to get skinny to wear it and I didn't get skinny enough. So that's that. Next, I have this little button up that I can't really show all the way because I just don't know what I'm doing. It's a button up. I wore it for work. I personally don't really like it that much because... You know, I just don't really like colors and designs like this, but maybe someone else will. It's in really good quality shape, whatever. It's a crop top, it's a sweater. Um, it's itchy, you probably want to wear something under it. But yeah, it's, this, is, this is it. I got these shorts that I wore once and they literally ran up my butt. So if you've got kind of a big butt, you might not want to buy these, but you know, if you have a cute little dainty little tiny booty, then these are the perfect shorts for you. I had this shirt for legitimately 10 years. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I had this since 2008. 2008! I like how I say that. It's really cute. It's like a little sheer shirt and it buttons, you know, like, whatever. This is another shirt that is really good quality. It's sweater. It's 
color blocking it's very form-fitting makes your curves stand out long sleeves it's pretty cute I just wear it so many times that I just don't want it anymore you know I had this since I was in ninth grade I'm no longer in high school it's been out of high school for five years so this is pretty old my friend but I love green like green's my favorite color and I was just trying to hold on to this for five years but it's called to go it's from um, Aeropostale yeah, do, 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 who, who still shops there? Who still shops there? Another shirt from Air Postal that I'm selling. It's very comfy, very form-fitting. I really love this shirt. I feel like I might not give it up. Can't give it up. This shirt I'm really going to make really cheap because there's like little thingies on them. Like cotton thingies. And I was just never able to get them off. It's from forever. And it's really cute because it has these little slits on the side. Ooh, you can show your stomach. Ooh. Yeah, I just don't want this anymore. I feel like I'm going to make this like five bucks. And then these I got from New York for like ten bucks. Again, my butt's growing. So, um, there's like a little, I don't know if you can see this. There's like a little stuff going on in the middle of there. So, again, if you have like a cute little tiny dainty butt, then these workout pants are great for you. Of course, green. That's why I got them. But I'm probably going to sell these for like three bucks. And then these jeans I got from freaking Urban Outfitters. What was that? Oh my god. These were like 60 bucks. And again, my butt grew. I can't fit these. These are very uncomfortable. They're really like good quality jeans and not what. But I just can't wear them anymore. So thank you guys for watching my video. Please like this video and subscribe click the link below to get all these clothes that i'm selling there might be some more stuff on there that you guys didn't see and i also might give you a bundle you know like a discounted price for all the items if you just buy them because they are just collecting dust be confident in the fact that i'm gonna wash all these clothes right before i give them to you so thank you guys do me and i sold it and i will see you in my next video and don't let anybody touch your body